in arguing the necessity for the Khilafah, Sheikh Al-Azhar quoted a hadith which is in Sahih Muslim. Listen to it. Mamata, whosoever dies. The Prophet is speaking, alayhi salatu wasalam. Mamata, walam yara fi unukihi bayya, whosoever dies, without the obligation of bayya upon him, his neck, meaning he had not given the pledge to obey the Amir. Faqad mata maytatan jahiliya. Such a person has died the death of Jahiliya. And so, even though the Khilafah is gone, we still have an obligation to give the pledge of, of Bay'ah to an Amir. It is, of course, a pity, a pity, a pity that the Sufis have used this terminology of Bay'ah for a pledge of obedience to the Sufi Sheikh. I wish they had never utilized this term, which belongs to our collective existence. Hmm? Bea, how then do we respond? How do we fulfill our obligations in order preserve, to preserve our Islam so we don't die in Jahiliya? What a terrible surprise would that be, eh? After we die, then we realize we didn't die in Islam. We died in Jahiliya. 